Good morning students. My name is Mohit and I'm a mathematics teacher in Mount Tetra Z School, Chhasi. In the previous video, you have studied about the types of fractions like like fractions, unlike fractions, proper, improper, equivalent and mixed fraction. Now, to, in today, uh, our today's topic is comparing fractions. That is, in this fraction, we will study greater or smaller fraction, ascending fraction, ascending or descending of fractions so let's get started so how to compare fractions I have written three examples over here in these three examples we will study that how to compare fractions so like for example in example number one I have written over here like 2 by 9 and 3 by 9 if I want to compare it how will I compare just it is simple that if the denominators are same there are two ways if the denominators are same but the numerators are different then you can directly compare the fractions like 2 by 9 and 3 by 9 you can see that denominators are same but the numerators are different so whichever numerator is greater the fraction will be greater for example 2 and 3 in 2 and 3 between 2 and 3 3 is greater it means 3 by 9 is the greater fraction because the denominators are same so in this case we did this we do this okay now what if the denominators are different now then what will you do you have two options either you can make the denominator same like 5 and 7 take the LCM and make it same denominators or it's the simplest way you can do it is the simplest method that you can do that you have to cross multiply the denominator by the numerators like if I multiply the 7 in 1 and 5 in 1 that is 7 and that is 7 1 the 7 5 1 the 5 that is 7 and 5 and you know that that 7 is greater than 5 it means this greater than will come over here in between 5 1 by 5 and 1 by 7 as it is it means the fraction 1 by 5 is greater than 1 by 7 or you can say that 1 by 7 is less than 1 by 5 so this is the procedure you can do that now the third one is like 6 by 7 and 7 by 8 still in the same case you can do this like 6 by 7 and 7 by 8 you can do cross multiplication over here like this so 6 8 is a 48 6 8 is a 48 7 7 is a 49 so you can write it 48 and you can 49 you know that that 49 is greater than 48 it means 6 by 7 is smaller than 7 by 8 or you can say that 7 by 8 is greater than 6 by 7 so this is the procedure you can compare any given two fractions now how do we do ascending or descending let's check it out like I have written the example like compare the fractions given below the fraction is 1 by 2 1 by 3 and 1 by 4 maybe the fraction can maybe the fraction will be 4 5 and 6 fractions so whatever fractions you have what you have to do is the step one that take the LCM first you need to take the LCM like 2 by three, uh, 2 3 and 4 these are the denominators of the uh, denominators which we have to take the LCM like 2 1s are 2 then it will not win and 2 2s are 4 again 2 1s are 2 then again 3 1s are 3 now the LCM is the LCM is 2 multiply 2 multiply 3 you can do that 2 2 is a 4 3 is a 12 it means the LCM is 12 now what you can do like uh, like 1 by 2 what you can do uh, you can write 1 by 2 uh, to make it 12 you can multiply by 6 if um, in denominator and you know that if you are multiplying any number in denominator or numerator you have to multiply in both the numerator and denominator for example if I am multiplying the 6 in denominator that means you have to multiply it in numerator also similarly to make it 12 to make denominator 12 now 1 by 3 to make 3 12 you can multiply by 4 because 3 4 is a 12 so you have to multiply 4 in numerator also 
1 by 4, you have to multiply 3 in 4, so you can multiply this 3 in numerator also. So 6 by 12, 4 by 12 and 3 by 12. You can uh, do it like this. So now the denominator is same. Now you can easily compare that which fraction is greater or which fraction is smaller. So if you want to come, if you want to write it in ascending or if you want to write it in descending, you can write it. For example, what can I do? Like 3 by 12 is now smaller than 4 by 12, smaller than 6 by 12. Or you can directly write it at simplest form like 1 by 4, 1 by 4, 1 by 3 and 1 by 2. So this is, you can do it for this descending order also like this. Now here are some examples which you have to practice at home. So I hope you like the video. So all the best students.